from the Franklin Broadcast Team. We made a video for you, for you new coming sixth graders to show you what Franklin's all about, all the school, staff, and teachers. Hope you like it. Hi there, my name is Mr. Varekin. I am the principal here at Franklin Middle School, one of the, the head of the Franklin family, our, our Franklin Panthers. And we are super excited to see you uh, this coming year. Uh, we wish you could. We wish we could have you in uh, personally, but with, uh, as everyone knows, you know, in the middle of a pandemic, uh, there are some issues. So, um, I'm super excited to meet all of you and and uh, get to know you. Okay. So, what is your favorite thing about Franklin Middle School? My favorite thing is all of you. I know that's kind of a cliche answer. You may have to look up what cliche means, but uh, I, I went into education because I love kids and I love teaching kids and. Just because I'm the principal doesn't mean I stop teaching. Sometimes I teach you, uh, you know, how important it is to behave well. Sometimes I teach you how to, how to follow rules and, and also how to just be a good person. Um, so I'm, I'm still an educator, even though I'm the principal. I may not be in your classrooms teaching you, but um, I, I really have invested my life in making sure that uh, all, I've been in middle school for 25 years. So I love middle school kids. Um, and and I, I expect that you all do your best and but that's why that's that's my favorite part about school is is all of you that's why I was super excited when on March 1st all of my this year's kids got to come back so what advice do you have for the new sixth graders that are coming to Franklin you know middle school is not that hard um, I know it's a transition from elementary school uh, it, it's a little bit different you have you go from class to class you don't uh, stay in the same place all day long, but really there's only a few things you have to do to be successful. The first is stay on top of your work. When you're assigned an assignment, do it. And if you stay on top of it and do your couple assignments that you get each day, then you don't get behind and it, it, does, it's, it isn't an issue. Um, the second thing is that we don't have a ton of rules, but if you follow the rules and do what you're supposed to do, then you'll have a fantastic experience. And, and my biggest piece of advice is enjoy your time here. Um, school is a fun place to be. You just have to make it that way. Um, and, and that's what we want you to do is have, have a good time at school. Enjoy your time here. It's not torture. It's some place you have to be, yes, but we, we want you to make the best of it and have a good time while you're here. Okay, thank you for your time. You're welcome. Welcome again to Franklin. We, are, we look forward to seeing you. Hello, incoming sixth graders. My name is Miss Hale. I am the assistant principal here at Franklin Middle School, and I'm excited to have you here in our building. Okay, so I've just got a few questions for sure. you. What is your favorite part about Franklin Middle School? One thing that I love at Franklin is we're one big family, and we're super active. There's lots of things in our family that you can participate in. We have clubs, we have really cool classes. Um, some of the other kids told me that we eat a lot of pizza and we drink a lot of smoothies for lunch and breakfast, so there's lots of fun things to do. You can um, do things like a chess club or a robotics club or math counts or participate in athletics or be involved in our talent show if you're, if you're a musical or there's lots and lots of fun things to do. Um, and we'll take care of you here at Franklin since we're one big family. Okay, so uh, what advice do you have for the new sixth graders? Sixth graders, one thing that I would tell you to do is don't be afraid to ask questions. Speak up. When you're here at Franklin, if there's somewhere that you um, need to go and you're not sure where it is, just ask. We're really, really helpful as far as um, other kids or other adults. We'll help you get where you need to go. If you're interested in something like a club and you don't and you need information, ask. Um, if you're lost in the building and you need to know where to go, ask. We're really, really helpful people and um, we'll make you feel really comfortable. Okay, one last question. Sure. Can you explain the sports offered at Franklin and the criteria for I, participating? I can. As your assistant principal, I'm also your athletic director. So as a sixth grader, there's three sports that you can participate in. In the fall, we offer cross country, so a running sport. You're welcome to participate in that. Um, in the winter, we offer wrestling, and wrestling is for boys and girls, as cross country is. And then in the spring, we offer track for sixth graders. The requirements are paying a $15 activity card fee, and then a $45 sport participation fee. 
and then you just have to have good grades. You got to make sure you're passing all your classes and you have at least a 2.0 GPA. So that's your overall grades have to be kind of kind of good to participate in sports. Once you're a seventh or eighth grader, there's a few additional sports that we add, volleyball, basketball, and the like, but we'd love to have you participate in those sports that we offer for sixth grade. Welcome incoming sixth graders. My name is Miss Foltz, but most people call me Miss D, which is a little easier. Um, and we're excited to have you guys. So what is your favorite thing about Franklin? So as the attendance secretary, my favorite thing is getting to know all of you students and your parents and getting to see your smiling faces every day. And what advice do you have for incoming sixth graders? So I have three things. One, the first one is make sure you come early and wander the halls and see where your classes are so you're not completely lost on the first day. Um, the second, which I got from a couple of eighth graders that we have, is make sure you're not afraid to make new friends. Keep the ones you have, but also reach out and make some new friends. And then the third, please memorize your parents' phone numbers before you get to school on the first day. Hi, my name is Angie Brown. I'm one of the counselors here at Franklin Middle School. I'm here for the last names of A through K. Actually, we're here for all of you, but just for purposes of trying to figure out who's who, I uh, usually work with the kiddos A through K with grades and stuff like that. Why do I like Franklin? I'll tell you why. You. I enjoy working with people like you. I look forward to the incoming sixth graders. I love working with the seventh graders. I love my eighth graders too. I have worked at the elementary for years and I did not know how much fun and how much enjoyment I would have working with middle schools. I love them. So best advice for sixth graders, Make good use of your counselors. Come see us for anything that you need. You need to know where to go. You need to find a classroom. You need to know how you're doing in class. You just name it. We, were, we are here for you. And also, um, make sure that we're going to be doing some classes on study skills. And we're hoping to see you in those classes. We hope to help you with some study skills that will make you even more successful in middle school. Anyway, if you have any questions, please come ask us. And welcome to Franklin Middle School. Thank you. So my name is Miss Diaz, and I'm one of the school counselors here. Um, I would have to say that one of my favorite things about Franklin is just being able to build those relationships with the students. and. Just the fact that everyone's so willing to learn and grow and to become a better version of themselves and um, just that family aspect that we have here at Franklin with the staff and with the students. Um, if I had to give advice for a sixth grader, I would say to not sweat the petty things, but also to not pet the sweaty things. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mrs. Rosa and I'm the registrar here at Franklin Middle School and my job is to build the master schedule for all the teachers and then schedule all the learners into the classes. I also keep track of all the paperwork and um, documents for learners, enroll new students and withdraw them. And what's your favorite part about working here? My favorite part about working at Franklin would be the learners and the staff. I love coming to work every day and I love what I do. What advice would you give to new sixth graders? My advice for incoming sixth graders would be to have fun and to remember that everyone's going to be nervous. Everybody's new to middle school. And so just to relax and enjoy your middle school years. And my name is Al Ms. Rao, Alice Rao, and I'm the college and career advisor here at Franklin Middle School. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Um, I think the kids are my favorite part. I love getting to know each and every one of you and learn about what you want to do with um, later on in life. And what advice do you have for new sixth graders? Um, have fun, but make sure you stay up on your work and um, just have fun. Hi, this is Mrs. Krebs from the library. What's your favorite part about Franklin? And my favorite part about Franklin? Well, I just love it when kids come in here and check out books and I love talking to kids about books. 
Um, it's really exciting to see um, when students really like a book, I recommend them. So that's really fun. What advice would you give to a new sixth grader about your library? Um, well, come in and check it out and see how it's laid out for sure. And um, always remember to turn in your books on time, or at least turn them in at some point, <laughs> and renew them when they need to be renewed. But um, there's a lot of stuff here and a lot of changes happening, and you'll be seeing that when you get here. My name is Mrs. Hicks. I teach 6th and 7th grade math. And what's your favorite part about teaching? Uh, I love it when kids uh, are struggling with math and then they get, they figure it out and it's that aha moment and they do a great job with that. And uh, do you have any advice for the incoming sixth graders? Yeah, um, work hard and stay caught up. It's really hard to get caught back up when you get behind. So work hard, keep working hard. Uh, we make mistakes, but that's okay. We can learn from them. My name is Mrs. Iverson. I'm a sixth grade math teacher and also the cheer coach here at Franklin Middle School. I love so many things about teaching. It is definitely my passion. It's what I do for fun. I enjoy learning and I love seeing all of the new students come in. They're all excited and they just soak it all up and have those moments where they're like, I get this, I understand, I'm learning. That's my favorite. And do you have any advice for the new sixth graders? Ooh, do I ever. Mrs. Iverson has lots of advice. So, if I am a sixth grader coming to Franklin, I would be so excited. This place is awesome. I want you to really, really enjoy yourself while you're here, so get involved. Be a part of things. Look for clubs and activities to join. Remember, they'll give you something to keep track of all of the new information because there's so much that you have to keep track of. It's called a planner. Use it. You will love the uh, habit that you develop in using that planner so you can keep track of all the activities, your assignments, the things the teachers need you to do, all those fun things that come with being a Franklin Middle Schooler. I'm so excited for you to come. I can't wait to meet you all and I hope you love sixth grade. I'm Jennifer McIntosh and I teach sixth and seventh grade math here at Franklin. What do you do? What's your favorite part about Franklin Middle School? I love working with the students and um, helping them understand a new concept that may have been difficult at first. What advice do you have for the new coming sixth graders? My advice for new students would be to try to keep up on your work so that when we learn something uh, the next day, uh, you're caught up and, and ready to learn that concept. Hello, I'm Mr. Keller. I'm the sixth grade teacher of science at Franklin Middle School. I've been asked to talk to you people today about why Franklin's so great. Well, Franklin's been around for a long time, you know. I went here back in the 80s that you guys all missed out on. We're trying to help you figure it out as much as possible, but it's, you know, we're doing what we can. Sixth graders, do you have any questions for me? I do. Yes. What is your favorite thing about Franklin Middle School? My favorite thing about Franklin, man, so many things. I, I think it is one of the best schools in Pocatello. Um, I, I love where it's at. I love the location. Um, I like the kids that come here. Um, and have you seen my chair? It's really comfortable. That's one of my favorite things, probably. Awesome. What advice do you have for the incoming sixth grade students? Work as though your life were in peril, for it really is. Thank Hello, you. I am Mrs. Keller. So I teach science here at Franklin to sixth graders and seventh graders. Um, what's your favorite part about Franklin? My favorite part is all of the learners. You guys are awesome and I get so excited to meet you guys as you come in as sixth graders to get to know you and then hopefully have you again in seventh grade and then see you in eighth grade as well. But getting to know you guys and having you for three years is kind of awesome. What advice would you give to a new sixth grader? New sixth graders, first off, don't be scared. I know it's something totally different, but just be excited about it. Come, I promise everybody's going to be a little nervous that first day, but we'll walk you through everything, tell you everything you need to know, so no worries there. And then just have fun. Get to know as many people as you can. Join as many different groups as you can. We have lots of different sports and activities you can join in and do, so participate and have a good time. I am Mr. Delanis. I am a sixth grade English teacher. 
What is your favorite part about Franklin? There's a lot of great parts. I'm looking at some of them right now. Great staff, wonderful staff, love working here. Amazing students. A couple of years ago, um, I actually had the opportunity to even either go to Irving or to Franklin, and it was a no-brainer. I wanted to be here with the best. What advice do you have for incoming sixth graders? Um, really, the, I, I have, it's called Stay on Track, and I have it in my room. I'm trying to look at it right now. Um, I'll share those with you. Just be prepared. Make sure you always come to class every day. Be prepared. Be productive. You have to be here. You're here anyhow, so do your best. Maximum effort. You know, you're here. You might as well do your very best with that. Um, no missing assignments. Missing assignments are a grade record. No missing assignments. And I'm trying to read the last one. What? Oh, and, and just pay attention. Just, just when you're in class, pay attention. So if you do those five things, you'll stay right on track. So Mr. Woods, how, what do you teach? I teach sixth grade English and seventh and eighth grade student leadership. Great. How long have you been teaching at Franklin? This is my ninth year here. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Franklin? I like Franklin because uh, it's one of the nicer schools in the area as far as the location in the city. I like it being in the foothills and I absolutely love the student body. They're awesome. What advice do you have for incoming sixth graders? Incoming sixth graders should read, read, read if you want to do well in English and just be able to understand that everybody is equal and treat everybody with respect and kindness and then everything will be fine and don't be afraid to come here. It'll be an awesome experience. Hi, I am Mrs. Tolman, and I am one of the sixth grade teachers here at Franklin Middle School. I teach world history, and in world history, we learn about different civilizations that happened thousands and thousands of years ago. For example, we were going to learn about Mesopotamia, we learn about ancient Greece, ancient Rome, ancient Egypt, and ancient China. So I really look forward to seeing you this next year, and we are going to have a blast learning about all these wonderful civilizations. What is your favorite part about teaching Frank, um, Franklin Middle School? I love Franklin Middle School. I love the students here, the teachers are great, we have just a great atmosphere, and we really look forward to having you come be with us. Do you have any advice you would like to share for the new sixth grade students? Um, just come and come be with us. We have a safe environment and um, just be prepared to learn and grow and have an amazing experience here at Franklin Middle School. Sure. Hi, I'm Mr. Campbell. Um, what's your job here at Franklin? Uh, right now I'm teaching uh, sixth grade uh, world, uh, world history, ancient civilizations, and also geography for seventh and eighth graders. Um, I also have a, a chess uh, class. Uh, if you have a flex with me, uh, I'll be teaching chess class. What's your favorite part about Franklin? About Franklin? Uh, mainly just the, the students. I like having conversations with them. The teachers are great here. It's just a, a great place to work. What advice would you give to a new sixth grade student? Um, mainly just keep organized, keep your stuff together, don't lose your assignments, and uh, as long as you have everything and you know, be respectful, uh, you sh shouldn't have any problems. Hi, my name is Kathleen Hefner and I teach English here at Franklin to grades six, seventh, and eighth. I also teach knitting and study skills. Uh, what is your favorite part about Franklin Middle School? My favorite part about Franklin is the wonderful staff we have here and how well every one of us work together. And I love working with students, watching that sparkle and that light come through when they get a concept. Okay, and what advice do you have for the new sixth graders? My advice for our new sixth graders is to come in every day ready to work and to work hard and do the best they can. Hi, my name is uh, Miss Caper. I'm a math teacher here at, at uh, Franklin. I teach sixth, seventh, and eighth grade math. Okay, uh, what is your favorite part about Franklin? Um, well, one thing we didn't get to do this year was the snow club, and that is one of my favorite parts because I am an avid snowboarder. Um, but I also really enjoy just um, 
how close of a family we are here at Franklin and how um, awesome everyone is to each other, whether that's the staff to each other or to the students uh, interacting with each other. So, Okay, and what advice do you have for the new sixth grade students? Hmm. Come prepared. Bring your pencil, bring your notebooks, um, and come to class prepared. Hello, my name is Mr. Hellman, and potentially welcome to all you future sixth graders. Uh, let's see, I'm the band director here at Franklin Middle School, and I think they're going to ask me a few questions here about... What is your favorite part about Franklin? My favorite part about Franklin? Well, we have an amazing team of teachers here at Franklin, and we have an amazing team of music teachers here as well. So you can get as much or as little out of either the band, the orchestra, or the choir, and we'll take you as far down that path as you want. I have phenomenal colleagues between Miss Bosey and Mrs. Hostenbluth. What advice do you have for the new sixth grade students? Oh, straight up. Don't be dumb. That's our band motto. Uh, and what that means is, is come in, make smart choices, advocate for yourself, ask questions when you don't understand something, and actually put a little bit of effort into trying before you just give up or say, I can't do it. And even just that little bit of effort, and, and if you start off that way, you'll realize just how much more fun middle school can be uh, rather than starting off from behind. So don't be dumb. That's our band motto. That's my advice to you. Hi, I'm Mrs. Hassenflug. I teach choir at Franklin. What is your favorite part about Franklin Middle School? My favorite part is the students, of course, and that I get to teach them every day all year. It's awesome. What advice do you have for new sixth grade students? If you are lost, uh, literally or figuratively, or you need help, ask for it. Don't wait until you're in a bunch of trouble. Just ask. Hi, I'm Miss Bosey, and I teach orchestra here at Franklin. What is your favorite part about Franklin Middle School? I love that at Franklin, uh, everybody seems to care about each other and wants everyone to learn and do well. What advice do you have for the incoming sixth grade students? Well, first of all, I'd say join orchestra because it's the coolest class. But whatever classes you join, make sure that you work hard and do your best. Hi, today we're in the cafeteria and we're just showing you around. Um, so every day we put on the blackboard what we're serving for that day. And then over here we put what we're having for breakfast every day. And then we have three lines. We have the daily line over there to the left. And then we have the main line here. And then we have the fast food line over there. Okay. Um, and then we are going to go downstairs and see the a la carte line. Okay, I'm just going to show you a little bit about our a la carte line. Board that has prices, and then the girls write on these every day what we're they're having to sell in their um, on their line today. Um, Amber, she's she's our a la carte person, and we'd love to help you. Just ask her any questions if you have any questions. And then Sadie will be running this till, and she also writes on her till. And if you have any questions, just ask her. Hey guys, I'm Mr. Hughes. I run the After School Academy. It's called FASA. Franklin After School something, something. I don't know. You guys know what FASA stands for? Franklin After School Study Academy. School Academy. Anyway, after school, you can come see me, all right, and my beautiful wife. And then you can hang out with us, we'll help you on your math and everything else. Um, I'm a demigod at math. I'm good at, I've done all the math problems already, I can help you. Usually that's when helping kids mostly is math at the after school. Uh, but everything. Uh, come, it's a nice environment. Expect to work. Yeah, I'm a dad, I'm gonna expect you to work. But I'm also gonna give you a piece of candy or something if you need it. You know what I'm saying? Um, it usually works out really good. So if you have any questions, come see me. Uh, my room's 214. I'm like in this hallway by all the weird stuff right here. And uh, yeah, we usually run it three times a week. Every year's a little bit different. Uh, so when you watch the video, uh, right now we're doing it on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Last year we did it on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Hopefully next year, this is for the kids next year, right? Yes. Hopefully when you guys are here, I'm doing it three times a week, okay? Sound good, ladies? Yep. All right.
See you next year. Hello, good afternoon. I'm Mrs. Hughes. I'm one of your after school uh, teachers that helps with tutoring and make, uh, making up classes and, and helping out with your subject matter. Hi, I'm Griffin. I'm a current eighth grader here at Franklin. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Um, just being able to see my friends all the time. Looking back on your middle school experience, what advice do you have for new sixth graders? Um, just get to know as many people as you can. And what helped you in dealing with new seven new teachers and classes? Um, just. The, the people at the older grades really helped me get to where I needed to go and the teachers are always super helpful. And do you feel like four minutes is enough time to get to your next class and is it enough time to use the restroom in between? Um, most of the time yeah, but every once in a while it takes me a little bit, but most teachers are pretty alright with that. Did you ever get lost trying to get to a class? If so, what did you do? Um, yeah, I got lost a couple times. And I went to the wrong class and I showed them my schedule and they showed me where I needed to be. What helped you to be successful in middle school? Um, just staying organized. And what are the positives about being in middle school compared to elementary? Um, you get a lot more freedoms and a lot more things that you can do. Hi, I'm Dax. I'm a current 8th grader here at Franklin. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Um, definitely the teachers. Uh, a lot of them are really nice. Some of them aren't so nice, but I like them all, pretty much. And looking back on your middle school experience, what advice do you have for new sixth graders? Um, it can be scary at some points, but don't be too afraid. It's not that scary. What helped you in dealing with having seven teachers and classes? Um, definitely my family. Uh, it was a lot easier since my older sister came here, so... It was nice getting some advice from her. Um, do you feel like enough, like four minutes is enough time to get to your class? And is it enough time to use the restroom in between classes? Um, definitely. There are some points uh, in my sixth grade year where I had to go to the bathroom a lot, so uh, four minutes is definitely long enough. Did you ever get lost trying to get to a class? And if so, what did you do? Um, I did once. It was in the first week of school. Uh, I accidentally went to my fourth hour period instead of my third hour period. And it was just a simple mistake, but I fixed it. And what helped you to be successful in middle school? Um, just kind of memorizing my schedule, uh, keeping everything kind of in a general area where I can get it for in between classes, I guess. And what are the positives about being in middle school compared to elementary? Uh, you have a lot more freedom than you usually do. Hi, I'm Eliza. I'm a current 8th grader here at Franklin. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Um, probably being able to see my friends and getting to talk to them every day. Looking back on your middle school experience, what advice do you have for your four new 6th graders? Um, to try to stay organized and bring a pencil to every class so you're prepared. What helped you in dealing with seven teachers in seven classes? Um, I liked how we got to like move around more and I tried to stay organized and that helped me. Um, do you feel like four minutes is enough time to get to your next class? And is it enough time to use the bathroom in between? Um, sometimes, but the teachers um, won't care too much if you're like a little bit late or something. Did you ever get lost trying to get to class? And if so, what did you do? I did get lost once, and I asked a different teacher for help, and she showed me where to go. What helped you to be successful in middle school? Um, just try to get all your missing assignments in. That's what I did. And then, like, just work hard. And what are the positives about being in middle school compared to elementary? Um, you get to move around more, and, like, you get to see your friends, like, and meet new people. Hi, I'm Clover, and I'm a current 8th grader at Franklin Middle School. What is your favorite thing about Franklin? Um, the teachers are really nice, and everybody's just positive all the time. Looking back on your middle school experience, what advice do you have for new 6th graders? Um, try to get good friends that will help you catch up on work and just help you in general. And what helped you in dealing with having seven teachers and classes? Um, having the planner that they give you helps because you can keep track of your schedule and what you need to do.
Do you feel like four minutes is enough time to get to your na next class? And is it enough time to use the restroom in between? Sometimes it can be a little hard to get to class on time, but if you're a little late, your teachers will understand. Um, did you ever get lost trying to get to class? And if so, what did you do? Um, I don't think I ever got lost, but if I did, I would just ask somebody in the hallway for help. What helped you to be successful in middle school? Being organized and having everything organized. <laughs> what are the positives about being in middle school compared to elementary? You have a lot more options and you have a little more freedom. Um,